today we're going to use Horizon, which is the automated system used by our library system, to make a new books list, which you can place at your library circulation desk or send to a newspaper or post on a website or a blog. We are showing the Horizon screen here and underneath the administration folder there is an item called item report which is the tool that you'll use to produce a new books list. Double clicking on the item report brings up a compound search window and in this window a good thing to do is to highlight one of the indexes at top which collection is a good one to start with and for instance if you know the collection which represents your fiction and in this case we'll use an example from one of our libraries the Moore's Library Fiction Collection has the code MOF so by highlighting collection and putting MOF in this area we have started by asking for a list of fiction at the Moore's Library. But we don't want all the fiction, so we're going to put an AND, mark the AND, and then we're going to choose another index at the top, which is down low in the list. It's called Creation Date. Now you wouldn't know what exactly to put in here, but there is a handy tool down here called Date Range. So by clicking on that, you can choose your date range or say since a certain date. In this case I'm going to say since July, which is 7, 1st of 2011, and I'll click OK. You could choose range if you wanted to say new books in July and give the beginning and ending date also. And I'm going to click OK and then I will click search. When you get the result, you can maximize it so you can see it better. And you see down here there are 15 new fiction titles in the Moore's Library since July 1st of 2011 as of this date, which is August 8th. Now the display button gives you the option to clean up this list so that it will look pretty uh, for a printed or published list. So we're going to display and choose what to display. Collection doesn't make much sense to people, so we're not going to display that. You could choose to display the call number, but in this case I'm just going to display the title and the author, and nothing else is highlighted. And I'm going to click OK. You can also sort this display so that it's in order by title using the sort button here. It uh, seems to sort the the uh, titles first, which is a little bit uh, incorrect. Or you can sort by author, which does work. If later when you have this in a word processing uh, program you want to rearrange the titles, you can also do that. I'm going to keep it sorted by author and then I will export using the file export records. I'm going to save it on my desktop and give it a name such as uh, New Books Wars July 2011 or maybe New Fiction would be better because you really could uh, also make uh, new nonfiction using this same method but choosing a different collection and importantly uh, you can put on an ending here to tell Windows what program to use to open this file which is if it's a DOC it will be opened by Microsoft Word and save it and in this particular place I like to choose the default option which is as displayed and click OK. Now I'm going to minimize the horizon window 
and here I see my file which is called New Books actually it's New Fiction this one I've done a couple different things so New Fiction and I'm going to double click on that I get a dialog box from Windows because it recognizes that this is a, a little bit of an unusual file not created by Word but certainly readable by Word and the preview looks okay so I will click OK and here's our file at this point I would delete this top line which is just an explanation of the search and not useful here and put in a title such as New Fiction at Moore's Free Library July 2011 and make that nice and big or maybe not quite that big and now here's our file all ready to print or copy and paste you can highlight and copy using the copy feature and put it in an email to your local newspaper or uh, send to your website and that's pretty much the way to do a new books list you can also do new DVDs or new nonfiction new juvenile fiction in the same way